Hey guys, welcome back to another video here at Creators Theory. In today's video, we'll see how to create a minimal logo animation in Filmora. Especially for this video, I have created a bundle of free logos and background images. The link to download this free material is in the description below. And before starting this tutorial, if you don't have the latest version of Filmora, then make sure you download it from the link in the description below. And if you're new to this channel, then make sure you hit the subscribe button to follow for more Filmora related tutorials. So let's get started with the tutorial. As you can see, I've imported all the media in the bin. So this media consists of three background colors and a logo image. So as I already mentioned, all these materials will be available for completely free download. The link is in the description below. So first I will bring, let us bring them into the timeline. So the total duration of this effect will be around eight seconds. So let me put this at eight. So this is the first Im uh, background image, about that we will have two more. So while initially starting the animation, you will be able to see this for a few seconds. So after that, I want this LiDAR image and about that, I want this image. So this basically is the background of the anim uh, logo animation. This is the main image. So this is not at the top and as mentioned, so we will start with the yellow and then it will be green and then it will start with the uh, dark the topmost one so what we'll do we'll decrease the size in the beginning and we will decrease this this much and uh, so as you can see we go a few seconds ahead you can we can see this light green type uh, background so uh, first what we'll do we'll double click on it and create a keyframe for this one so first we'll go a few seconds ahead uh, over here where the where you can see this one let me just remove it for now let me keep it over here and let me select this and add a keyframe and let me again go to the first uh, key, uh, first frame of this uh, background image and move this completely out So now if you go back and play, you can see it moving from left to right. Now we will do the similar thing. We will bring the uh, uh, this topmost background layer. But what we will do, we will add a little delay to it. As you can see, when it is almost at the half, what I will do. First we will uh, animate the uh, last frame which we will keep uh, just one or two frame ahead of this animation where it ends, this green animation. So again double click, click on add keyframe and again go to the first frame over here and drag it behind. So now click on OK. Now if you play this, let's see as you can see that's the animation now similarly we'll do it for the end part as well so what we'll do we will bring it a little down so for this closing animation as you can see the length of this uh, bottom layer uh, and this will be the total animation length of this topmost layer over here for closing animation so similarly i will double click on it click on add keyframe and i will go to the last frame and uh, over here i will move this completely back again to the left side from where we bought it so now if you move you can see it going back so for this second layer what we'll do as you can see now once it moves halfway through till here i want this animation to start so again i will double click on it click on add keyframe and i will go i will so as you can see this is a little ahead of this one so when it reaches this last point this will be always almost be closed and this will end a few seconds later after that so as you can see click on ok now let's just see how this looks so as you can see it closes after that and this is the background color so now if you see the entire animation like this and like this so this is the what we made animation inside there so if you don't want to make this animation and don't want to go through all the hassles you can simply go into transition and here 
inside slide show you will find linear and here there is linear one so what you can do you can simply add this but this is a predefined color so that's why i wanted my own color so i designed it from scratch and uh, once we have added this transition we will go ahead and add the image that we want the logo image so this is one of the logo image customized logo image that i created so let me just decrease the size so i will first center it so what i will do we will add a detail animation to this as well let us decrease this a little bit more so for the first keyframe it will be at the center of the frame and we will add a keyframe over here but what we will do we will make this as 0% opacity as you can see the opacity of this is 0% click on add and uh, click on add then make it 0 and uh, move it a few frames ahead and here what we'll do we'll move it a little right we'll make the opacity 100 and we'll click on ok so now if you see this animation so as you can see it goes from 0 to 100 and similarly at the end we will do again for closing we will again add it over here and for the last frame we will move it again to the center of this uh, frame and make it zero and click on ok so if you see this animation now from start so this is the animation and now we will add the text also so now once we have added the image animation what we'll do we'll simply go into the titles under titles we will find a suitable uh, title to add over here so let me see okay let me add this one and uh, double click on it and let me write something dream let me change the font so once you have selected the font let me just resize it and place it over here and uh, let me go into advanced and here what i will do i will go into animation select the left dir animation and as you can see this is the starting animation and if we go behind this is the closing animation so it starts from the left and goes to the right and goes back again to the left from the right so click on ok and we will size this with this one and as you can see if, you, if i zoom in you can see let me place this halfway so as you can see this animation below and this uh, uh, text animation starts halfway so that they have almost a similar motion towards the left so once we are done with that let's see how it looks while closing we will again add it halfway through while closing with over here so if we close as you can see let me just increase this and let's see how it looks yes it closed similarly or we can just go into advanced and we can might decrease this a little bit click on ok let's see now so it's almost in the same pace so once you're done with that click on ok just copy this one if you want to create another one and just go ahead and paste over here and just drag this above this now what i will do i will write another text which is studio and i will place this below over here dream studios let's write studios that would sound better and let me just align it click on ok let's see how it looks okay this is a little okay sorry let me just place it below and uh, let us see how it looks so we are i guess almost done let's see this complete animation
so that's it guys with this simple minimal animation you can do it by yourself without any knowledge of graphic motion graphics or anything so if you want to download these materials for practicing you can download it from the link in the description below it is completely free uh, there is a bundle of logos and background images that i have created so go ahead and download it and if you want to see more uh, animation videos that we created and uh, earlier we had a logo animation motion graphics and explainer video animation created in this channel so you can check that out by clicking in the top right corner and if you guys like this video then make sure hit the thumbs up button and if you want to see more videos like these one then make sure you hit the subscribe button see you guys in another video till then see ya